guys tonight's dinner is tuscan creamy chicken with some garlic bread that's left over ciabatta and baguette from tra uh, from costco and i just slathered slathered garlic butter that i picked up from whole foods and just heated that up in the oven and then um my caesar salad on a board yay so yummy so um oh, delicious very quick and easy that's the trader joe's chicken put some basil on it from my garden um some white wine and cream sauce and that is dinner tonight tonight's dinner is baked potatoes with cheddar cheese and leftover pork that i uh, heated up with barbecue sauce and broccoli that's dinner tonight Hey guys, so dinner tonight is grilled chicken with green beans and cauliflower and the Trader Joe mac and cheese bites. I put those in the air fryer and this chicken is chicken thighs from Trader Joe's that got seasoned with the um, lemon pepper garlic seasoning blend that I have from the Savory Spice Shop. So that's dinner tonight. Mine. <laughs> Tonight's dinner is spaghetti and meatballs. I made these meatballs with ground beef from Costco. So part of it I make meatballs, the other part I actually brown. That's homemade marinara sauce from the San Marzano tomatoes that I get from Costco, Nina. And then I had this leftover bread, so I drizzled it with garlic oil and I put it in the oven at 415 degrees. So we made some garlic bread. And then we have some broccoli with leftover peas in there for dinner. And that's dinner. Hi guys, so dinner tonight is Italian sausages and kielbasa because I had a little bit of kielbasa left over and my boys like that better than Italian sausages. So me and my husband are eating Italian sausages with peppers and onions and he's grilling that outside. And we're having that with pierogies. Ooh, this is hot. So some cheese pierogies. I got these at Publix. Um, I haven't seen these before, so I bought two boxes, and I just have them heating up in some ghee. So that's, oh, and then we're going to have that with broccoli, and that's dinner tonight. And here is the kielbasa plated, um, pierogi and broccoli. And then mine and John's plate is the kielbasa, not the kielbasa, sorry, the Italian sausage with peppers and onions, broccoli, and pierogies. And that's dinner tonight. So dinner tonight is spaghetti chicken. Um, when I had surgery, a neighbor of ours brought this dish over and we all really loved it. And she sent it over with a salad and a homemade dressing. Um, I know the Pioneer Woman made the chicken spaghetti on one of her shows. So I, again, uh, got the recipe but didn't really follow it to a T. I looked at other recipes and kind of incorporated a little bit of the different recipes. Um, I didn't really tape what it, how to make it because I wasn't sure how it was going to come out. Um, but that's what we're having for dinner tonight. And if it does come out good, I will put the recipe below and we're going to have it with a salad, which I still have to cut. So that's it. Tonight's dinner is empanadas with salad. And I made a homemade vinaigrette of olive oil, apple cider vinegar, maple syrup, uh, Dijon mustard, salt and pepper. That's dinner tonight. Guys, so dinner tonight, I had, um, I thawed out a bag of marinated chicken, which is in my savory spice shop blend of, I believe, Hidden Cove lemon garlic. Sorry. And then in the freezer, I had frozen Puerto Rican beans, so that's thawing out. And then in the freezer, I have a big bag of leftover white rice. So that's what's going to be for dinner tonight. And there it is, plated. I made some veggie blend with some butter. Um, I believe, no, that's the Whole Foods one, not the Trader Joe's. Uh, there's the chicken with the rice and the beans. And I also made some maduros. That's the frozen Goya maduros. Um, great to have in the freezer. They're so delicious. But that's what's for dinner tonight. 
So tonight's dinner is grilled these things. The Hormel lemon garlic pork loins. Got two of those. Gonna thinly slice them after they're grilled. And then I'm going to make pasta alfredo with this rotele wagon wheel pasta. Make the alfredo sauce. And then I'm gonna add veggie blend to that. So let's mix it all together. So that's what's for dinner tonight. There's dinner. That's the wagon wheel Alfredo with some veggie blend in it. It's in there. I put a whole bag. And um, the lemon garlic Hormel pork loin. So good grilled. Stays nice, moist, and tender. That's what's for dinner tonight. Guys, so tonight's dinner is homemade pizza. Trying a new recipe for the dough. Hopefully it comes out. Um, if it does, then I will post it. <laughs> And then I'm gonna make a Caesar, Caesar salad with that. Um, mm, can't wait. Looks good. I just hope it tastes good. And there it is. Homemade pizza, new pizza dough recipe. I'll post the recipe if it's good. And um, Caesar salad. That's dinner tonight. Hey guys, so this morning I'm taking out um, for dinner the frozen chicken thighs from Trader Joe's. I didn't marinate them. Um, I'm gonna let them uh, defrost, thaw out, and I took out some chicken stock that I made, um, and I'm gonna make this from the Savory Spice Shop, the Saffron and Chanterelle Risotto. Uh, made it before, made it several times um, for the family, and they really, really like it, so that's gonna be dinner tonight when I come home. So, I'm leaving that out now. There it is, nice and plated. The risotto from the Savory Spice Shop. It's the uh, Saffron Chanterelle risotto. Um, petit pois, so uh, little peas with some butter. And then the chicken thighs, Trader Joe's chicken, chicken thighs that I pan cooked with the Bohemian Forest um, spice blend from Savory Spice Shop. And that's dinner tonight. <laughs>